Good morning, Atherton. You're watching Atherton on Air. I'm your host, Amelia Barber. And I'm your host, Molly Jeb. Here's what's trending. On Tuesday, some juniors and seniors were inducted into Rho Kappa. So Rho Kappa is essentially a service club that is similar to NHS, but it's more of a historical and like social studies based club. So um, a, social, a social studies teacher has to be the sponsor for it. And essentially when you're inducted as a junior, we ask that you get 30 hours of, of service. And two of those 30 hours has to be um, a historical hour, which basically means you do, you know, some sort of service related to history and like um, maybe even like the Fraser Museum or something. And then you write a one page um, reflection about it to count as your historical hour. And currently we aren't accepting any new members, but we had about 60 that we inducted into the club this year, which is super exciting. It was a mix of both juniors and seniors. Um, and we're really excited to kind of get the year started with um, our new advisor, Mr. Smith. Congratulations to all the Rho Kappa inductees. This year, Atherton has many new teachers. Today, we'll be introducing you to one of them, Mr. Lee. Okay, well, good morning. My name is Bill Lee, and I am the engineering teacher here at Atherton High School. I started at UPS in 1984, and I worked there for 36 years. Uh, some of the assignments I had, I started out part-time and went back to school. I graduated from the University of Louisville Speed School in industrial engineering, and upon graduation, I was promoted into our engineering department at UPS. Yes, so I've worked in uh, flight ops, flight operation engineering, I've worked in aircraft maintenance engineering, and just recently, this past December, I retired. I had the opportunity to retire, and an opportunity came up to teach school here at Atherton, so I jumped right on it. I've always had a desire to teach. I thought I'd be teaching math, but the engineering program is growing here, which is a wonderful program, and I was given the opportunity to teach engineering, which is a wonderful program. Oh, my teaching life is going fast. It's, it's fast paced for first year teachers. I've found that out. It's a lot of training, but uh, it's, it's fun. It's enjoyable. The youth here are great. Um, I look forward to every day when I get up in the morning to be able to come to Atherton. I couldn't say that about every place I've worked, but it's, it's a wonderful thing. Welcome to Atherton, Ms. Lee. This year, you may have seen students skateboarding around school. But this isn't regular skateboarding, it's fingerboarding, also known as tech decking. We talked to Bobby Brashear and Anthony Arnold who take part in tech decking. You have a little mini skateboarding, you use your fingers to do tricks, just like they're your feet. Some of my favorite tricks to do are to pop an ollie and a uh, tray flip. Uh, I got into it in like 2015, because I was at a skate park a while ago and they had a cheap one in the uh, shop section and I bought it and it's been, I've been fun, it's been fun doing it ever since. If you or anyone you know has any unique hobbies, DM us on Instagram at atherton.on.air. On Friday, the Atherton football team beat Campbellsville 14-7 in a rainy game. Touchdowns were scored by Chance Thompson and Quayshawn Thompson. Tonight, North Bullet is coming back to Atherton for revenge in the first round of playoffs. Be sure to come out tonight at 7 p.m. to support the Ravens. Looking for some after-school fun? Let's get into our hallway headlines. This afternoon, Louisville mayoral candidate Shamika Parrish Wright is coming to talk about her campaign with Atherton students in room 217B. 4-H Community Cares Club meets in room 209 on Wednesdays from 2.30 to 3.30. 4 H Lead and Learn meets in room 209 on Thursdays from 2.30 to 3.30. The Super Smash Club meets in room 207 every Thursday from 2.30 to 4. Do you have extra Halloween candy? Miss MacArthur in room 128 is accepting candy through November 12th to be donated to the Franciscan Soup Kitchen. Making a difference for freshmen and sophomores meets during second period on Wednesdays. Making a difference for ages 16 and up meets during second period on Tuesdays. Phenomenal Women meets on Thursdays during sixth period. And that's all we have for today. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Amelia Barber. And I'm Molly Jett. Rock, Rock on, on Ravens. Ravens.